customer Aaron Swenson bought from us online today. So I'm happy. Sales go up, I'm happy. It went out today, I'm happy. What if she's not at home? She, she won't, won't be, be happy. happy. Use UPS. She can get a text alert, reroute, even reschedule a package. It's UPS, my choice. You happy? I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. I'm happy. 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 I love logistics. I mean, I'm, I'm always, I, we, I know we had one of our backups got injured today and they took him off the field, but I think w w when you don't see the major knee injuries or things like that, you're really ex pleased because this late in the year, it could be uh, season ending. So we got through that. Uh, and really, I'll be honest with you, I, I saw enough of things that I really like. I saw a little more consistency and ability to run our offense by our first team offense than we could last spring. I think we saw them, consist especially the consistent drive right down the field, the first drive against our defense. But maybe more important, that our defense was 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 faced with three turnovers by the second offense, put in bad situations, and they did not give up another touchdown the rest of the day. Two field goals made, two field goals missed. The two offense gave had three interceptions, which uh, uh, doesn't bode well there, but it also shows us that our defense, when put on the field extra times, were able to stand up and not give but one touchdown away. We're, we're better at running a, our basic plays uh, uh, correctly than we are at making a big play. Now, and there's two things that are different. You got to remember, you, you, everybody would love to have consistent 12, 16 play drives, uh, five, six yard pops. But when you have 11 people, that's 11 blocks, 11 possible uh, penalties, uh, 11 missed assignments, those kind of things are very, very hard to do. So what separates the, the great offenses is there's a guy that can take a short hitch pass that like you see us throw on the edge and take it 60 yards to 80 yards or a running back mm -hmm. that just makes everybody miss and goes. We still lack that. You know, the fact that we get turnovers uh, uh, and our number one offense uh, doesn't put more points on the board is, this, is the lack of big play uh, capability. We can't do anything about that. We do the best we can and make sure that, hey, no penalties. Don't no missed assignments. Let's drive the ball down the field like we did the first time. So the big thing is, uh, as far as consistently being able to run our offense, I thought we were much sharper now than we were this time last year at doing it. And uh, uh, we just got to continue to improve there and then see if we can get some big plays. When, when, we, when, when you get, we get that one or two guys that can, that can take it to the house and can, can make everybody else right, you know, uh, then, then I think that'll be the, the, the only ingredient we're missing. I think offensive line-wise, I don't have to look at the video. I know from practice that we've got to get more depth quickly and we've got to establish five starters on the offensive line. Jared Pugsley did not play uh, at, with his cause of injury. Uh, and we've got a couple of transfers coming in uh, that have played Division I uh, BCS level football that we've got coming in that could help us as well.